the dash, do the dash. I got one foot on the gas. I can't let no one in front of me. I can't let nobody front of me while I do the dash, do the dash. I got one foot on the gas. I can't let no one in front of me. Success on the way, I can feel that shit coming on yo. This one for the Dell. All the days I was living out in hell. Back when me and mama used to argue every summer cause that bottle had us living in the shell. Hey, what it do, y'all? What it do? It's your girl, Danny Chu. And I'm back, baby. Yes, I am back with another video, guys. This right here is kind of my first voiceover, y'all. So please be patient with your girl. Please. But before we get into this good, lovely video, which we kind of already in it, but don't forget to like, subscribe comment hit that bell all that good jazz so you can keep seeing these videos y'all so right here i'm doing a little watch me work of my sun kiss acrylic that i had mixed together um if you haven't seen that video go check that out i put it in the description or in the little icon box above y'all but right here basically um like I said, it's a watch me work. So yeah, as y'all can see, your girl got a new little little angle going on, as you can see. It's an overhead little thing. So please be patient with me. I go out of frame a couple times. And y'all, the camera might switch up to a couple times. Again, be patient. So at first, as you see, I start with my pinky. It was my Mia Secret. Um, what is that color? Dang, what is that color? I can't believe um, I'm, I'm drawing a right frosted pink. Mia Secret Frosted Pink. And now I am going in with my Sun Kiss colored acrylic that I made. Um, like I said again, you check that video out. And so, yeah, I really did not know what I was doing. So, what I was going to do. So, I went ahead and just recorded my second hand, my non dominant hand, y'all. So, if it's looking kind of crazy, I'm actually using my dominant hand. I'm using my non-dominant hand to do my dominant hand. So, you know, you get me. Just be patient with you, girl. But, um, I guess I'll just jump in every time it's, you know, something interesting. Oh, also, I forgot, y'all. Don't forget about my giveaway coming up. Get a thousand subscribers. Your girl is going to send out a Melanie Susie portable drill. It comes with some drill bits and some um, sanding bands. Um, so what you have to do to enter that contest is um, like all the videos, follow me on Instagram, which the description is down below, and also um, type done under whatever video you end up watching. It doesn't matter. You don't have to do it under each one. But if you watch this one and you hear that, you know, just hit done or any other one. It doesn't really matter. Um, let's see what else. Follow me on Instagram. Yeah, that's right. Follow me on Instagram. Like, turn the notifications on, and comment down below. Done. That's it. Simple. At a thousand, the portable drill could be yours. Fingers crossed. And I know some people said that they don't have an Instagram. Um, if you don't, that's fine as well. Just um, still comment down below. You'll still be entered. You know, it is what it is. Okay, and then some of these nails, y'all see I'm not going all the way down. Uh, jump back to the nails. Uh, sorry. <laughs> I'm not going all the way down because I'm doing ombre. And I find that it's easier for me to ombre my top color. Come almost down to the um, cuticle. Helps me better. So again, y'all, like I said, I'm sorry for going out of frame. And if I'm talking too much, I do that when I'm nervous. So... Again, I'll jump back in if I need to say anything else. If not, just listen, watch and listen.
Okay, guys, so if y'all know me, you know I'm not no dull chick. So I got to add some little shimmer, shimmery, bang, bang to it. So on my frosted pink nail, I am adding some um, butterflies that I have, some iridescent butterflies, some iridescent um, glitter. And the glitter that you see right in front of me is actually not the full mix I like kept dropping my glitters that I was using so I just mixed them all together to do my non-dominant hand um I meant to do my dominant hand so I was just like you know whatever just mix together put it in um and then on the second finger as well the full yellow I'm adding again the same thing some um butterflies by this time y'all I was frustrated because I kept like I said um dropping and spilling over my glitter so by this time I was a little frustrated, so I didn't really, you can't really tell the butterflies and I ain't really show them off good, so I'm sorry about that. But I, everything that I use will be in the link description down below, so don't forget to click on those links and see what we got. Um, but yeah. Support, support us, give a little support. Uh, <laughs> you hear the boo in the background. I also want to give y'all a little tip that you know y'all know i'm self learning doing this journey or whatever but a little tip that i also want to give to the to the newbies or whatever to make sure you pinch pinch your brush um there are different videos on youtube of how to basically pinch it once i pinch my brush that made such a world of a difference guys world of a difference pinch pinch a brush i don't know if every nail tech tell you at the beginning but pinch your brush just pinch your brush Pinch your brush. That's all I can say. Pinch your brush. And as you see right now, I have my Melody Susie Scarlet Drill with, I believe those are Melody Susie um, Drill Bits as well. It's the, not the ceramic, yes, the ceramic drill bit. So right now I'm just doing a little bit more shaping and a little bit more fouling, guys. I used to be, no lie, y'all, I used to be scared of my drill because I did cut myself a lot of times. I used to be scared of my file and scared of my drill. So now I just take my time a little bit more and I feel like I'm starting to get the hang of it now. Um, so yeah, so again, this is the Melanie Susie Scarlet Drill. I'll have that linked in the description below. And I also have it in the an unboxing. Of course, y'all know I have plenty of unboxings, but that's also an unboxing. If you want to check those out as well. Y'all, I'm going to tell you, girl, because came far one day i'm gonna show y'all one day i'm just gonna do some slideshows of my old nails because baby your girl used to not foul good none of that none of that So now, right now, I'm going over just with my um, standing bed and just kind of clear, cleaning it up. I might have other uh, drill bits, but I go kind of go between that and okay. other stuff as well. Um, my other drill bits as well. It just depends how I feel and what I pick up. Um, and then, y'all, I'm still a newbie at my filing. Like I said, I've just now kind of, within the last two sets that I have done, gotten um, 
comfortable with my drill and actually fouling now. So I'm still working on getting them crisp, 100% crisp. Um, and it's, if you can't tell, my fingers are cricket. So the dude, like, he ain't even gonna lie, my mom has always said, I get my fingers from my, my daddy's side because they're big and they're cricket. So sometimes it's kind of hard putting the nail on straight or if I do put it on straight, like, I don't know, it's just hard to explain. It's, it's, it's hard to explain. So, um, like with fouling, I'm looking at them and I feel like I'm fouling them straight. But then when I look at my nail, I'm like, no, you didn't. You know, I turn my hand around. It's because my fingers are cricket. So I'm trying to figure out how to do that once I get that underway. You know what I'm saying? But, oh, I also didn't really show me filing um, with the hand file because, like I said, I'm still trying to get used to that. And I ain't gonna lie, it was warm in my room too, in my nail room when I was doing my nails. Um, so the acrylic, a lot of the acrylic was um, drying fast. Another tip that you can do is put your um, monomer in the refrigerator for like five, ten minutes to cool down if you have a hot room, and then it'll slow down the process or add. Um, um, acetone so right here guys I'm also adding I'm also putting oil on it I'm using the beauty supply of store oil just so I can go wash my hands and come back and here I am so now guys I am getting ready to do my bling <laughs> the queen of bling I, I, I name myself the queen of bling only because I always put bling on my nails but I'm putting it in the atmosphere your girl is the queen of bling so you know she got to put bling on every finger even when y'all I don't feel like doing it. I'm like, you know what? I'm not putting any bling on every finger. I'll tell myself that when it's time to decorate, guess what? It's bling on every finger. So right here, <laughs> so right here guys, I start with um, my resin glue. Um, normally, I put my resin glue and then put everything that I want to add, but I wanted to make sure those two diamonds, or that diamond and that little teardrop, I call it, was secure um, before I added the rest. So now I'm just showing you that I put my hand in the lamp for about 90 seconds. Um, it's a lamp that I got with my, my Model 1 kit. Description and everything will be will be in the, links will be in the description below, sorry. Um, and so normally I just put glue on it, top coat, then put all the gems, every gem that I'm gonna use and put it in the light. Um, but I didn't do this time. Um, I actually have an LED light flashlight that I can use for a small thing, um, but I haven't picked up a battery for it yet, so that's why I did it like this. So again, like I said, I'm using Model 1's top coat that came in my Melanie Caesar kit, and I also have some individual ones, so that will be in the description below. Yeah. <laughs> Skills, school's been daddy in the background, like, he just don't need care, he's playing 2K, and that's the end of it. <laughs> So also right now you I have my caviar beads that I ordered off Amazon. Again, link will be in the description below. Um, this really is my first time using them. And I think it actually came out pretty cute. Um, and also if you're um, interested in the coaster that I have below, I have an actual a four set coaster. I ordered it from my girl Taylor May. Um, so if you put your put that in the comments down below if you're trying to figure out where I get um, That coaster and then I have a coaster at the end of my video when I'm doing my pictures and stuff like that um, Just comment down below and I'll be able to Get her information to you some kind of way if you want to order like I said, it's a four pack of coasters mm. Right here. I'm just lining up them caviar threes As nicely as I possibly can and guys comment down below if you like the new angle I'm like I said I'm still working on perfecting it uh, I was just so excited and put it up and then what's actually funny because you're gonna see that the angles change in a minute or after a couple of nail sets um, or nail design sorry and it's because I actually had my phone sideways and when I tell you making this trying to actually make this video like edit it for you has been I'm not gonna say hell because it ain't been too too bad but it's been discouraging because I had to flip it around it's a lot but I got your girl got it out for you that's why I'm having to do a voiceover because <laughs> you know <laughs> we're just gonna leave it at that 
So yeah, now you see I'm adding caviar um, bead. And let me also say this, guys. I go on YouTube, Facebook, all the stuff, and look at nails and nail designs. And that's how I come up with one on each finger, basically. Some of them can be just creative, but sometimes I don't know um, what I like. Y'all see, look. You see how I just dropped everything again? That's like my third time dropping that. So I tried to show y'all how I'm trying to pick them up while I had my hand under the light but couldn't do it. So, like I said, I was dropping stuff all day long. All day long, y'all. It's not even funny. It's not even funny. I know I forgot what I was saying, but hopefully it come back to me anyway. So now we're just moving on to the next finger. Oh, I forgot to tell you what the ombre color that I use. That is going to be my um, Mia Secret Pink Cover Pink. Um, normally, I use my Cover Blush, but I wanted to put a little spray. I mean, the blush and the pink, they're basically the same color. The blush just has, I mean, the pink just has sparkle in it. And I also got some opals. I used the opal because it kind of had some of the flake. So, oh, excuse me, guys. Some of that color in the flakes that I added and glitter that I added on the roll, um, not rose pink. Oh, man, frosted pink, whatever. So, again, just putting these on. If you're also interested in that, um, really all the rhinestones and everything I basically use, I get off of Amazon. So, just come in, <laughs> just look below in the description of all the tools that I got or have, excuse me, correct my English. I love that little coaster. It actually looked pretty, it looks pretty good in here. Shout out to Taylor. And I also see a lot of young ladies saying that they feel like they're too young to do nails and all this other stuff. Man, baby girls, y'all, duets, follow your dreams. If that's what you want to do and you want to try that and you want to go ahead and try it. There's not there's nothing wrong with that. Use your creative mind, baby. Use it. See, y'all, see what I was telling you about the angle change? I actually have forgot to put this in the clip, so when I had to put it back in, anyway. But I'm also using my Mia Secret, um, resin glue um, activator spray that's what I sprayed before I went into the lamp for 90 seconds I actually cure 90 seconds between each nail I always like to choose which my what's my favorite nail but this one is kind of hard to do this time. I kind of slick like the nail that I'm working on now. It's pretty, but then them other ones just do something else. They do something to me. And y'all, I'm working from home right now, so ain't nobody even really looking at my nails. I'm basically looking at them myself. At least when I was doing my nails before I was at work and, you know, could kind of show them off, honey. I'm sitting at home. I'm sitting at home. Only people that see him is me and my boyfriend. Just looking at him. Just looking. See, look, 
thing was switched yet again, guys. Again, be patient with your girl. She's still new. Also got these brushes right here and another um, resin glue clip that I ordered. Um, that will be linked in the description below. And I'm actually only going to show y'all, um, show me designing this hand because you know I didn't want the video to be too too long that's why I didn't show my prep and all that trying to do something different you know put some content out for you guys and girls girls and gals and right here I'm just putting random random you know look at that it's so pretty you girl is so proud of herself y'all i'm very hard on myself very very hard on myself so it's very i like my every time i do my nails but i'm so hard on myself that i see the imperfection i don't give myself benefit of the doubt uh, when people say they like them i just i didn't believe you know i just i don't know that's very bashful but it, it makes sense to why because you, you should say see where i came from the girls <laughs> nails were whoo bless my heart bless my heart and then now we just you know i'm not gonna lie this last design that i do has always been my favorite design it's so simple but at the same time it's still blingy it's still elegant and i think maybe next time i might do all my nails like that but i don't know basically just putting random diamonds, random, random rhinestones everywhere, well at the top half. And if you can see, you can see a little sparkle, if you see that little sparkle, that's the sparkle that is in that um, covered, covered rose. The covered rose used to be my favorite, like nude, but that cover, that cover blush, Without the sparkle, it's just something about it. It just does something. See, I'm just grabbing random sizes. Just putting them in random spots. Like the random girl I am. That coaster is bomb, I'm sorry. <laughs> I ain't never really got to look at it. Look at it. That coaster is bomb. Okay, let's get a little resin. Good. Okay, and look, guys, there we have it. The finished product of that hand, that finger. Pretty cute. And so, like I said, I didn't show you my um, second hand. Right now, I'm using my oil to get on them cuticles. Some things is dry. And that will be linked in the description below. Yeah, doing my nails is an all day thing, baby. Look at them bad boys. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> You've been sun kissed by Danny Jill. <laughs> sun kissed. That was a pretty fast say so, my dog himself. I'm so proud of myself. Y'all guys, thank you for sitting and listening to your girl. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment down below. Don't forget about the giveaway. I'm just living my best life. Living my best life, living my best life, living my best life.